Hey crypto fam, it's your boy Jojo with another crypto update. I appreciate you guys stopping by the channel. You guys are the only interaction in my day where I can talk about crypto and I get a weird look when talking to randos at work or even family members. Anyways, the FBI reports that a whopping 5.6 billion was lost in crypto fraud. Let's jump right into it. The FBI Internet Crime Complaint Center, aka the IC3, latest report shows that crypto fraud is on the rise, guys reporting losses to be around $5.6 billion. The IC3 received over 69,000 complaints involving financial crimes linked to Bitcoin, Tether, and Ethereum, which makes sense because those three tokens are the most popular crypto investors buy and use. The age group that gets scammed the highest are people who are over 60 years old. I recently made a video about scammers who are targeting the elderly to use Bitcoin ATMs and selling their Bitcoin addresses, guys. I'll link that video in the description below. Make sure you check it out. However, it's just not the elderly who are getting scammed. Let's go over the complaint chart together. All right, guys, let's go over this chart. 2023 complaints by age group. We have under 20 years old and over 60. As you guys can see, look how much money that 20 year olds and below lost. 14745000 compared to the elderly over 60 years old. 1,648,455,000 dollars guys and then you got the in between of um, losses due to scams these numbers are just staggering so now that we know what age group are getting scammed the most let's go over where and how these scammers target their victims like i mentioned earlier guys you have the bitcoin atm scam there's also the scam where a call center contacts you acts like they're your financial bank or crypto exchange representative stealing your info to get access to your accounts another crypto scam that many investors get hit by is a liquidity mining scam this is where the scammers have you stake your crypto into a liquidity pool promising you high interest rewards for the staking these staking pools are usually linked to a wallet that these scammers have access to oh yeah don't fall for the play to earn crypto video games online guys these are those scams that involve you playing online games to earn crypto. They're usually like farming simulations or raising crops. Anyways, I've lost count of how many times people have been scammed from those games. You have to remember the developers of those games have backdoor access to those accounts. Many people might wonder why I talk about a lot of negative things when it comes to crypto. Even though I'm a supporter of crypto, guys, I just want people to be careful of all the pitfalls when it comes to investing in this market. There's a lot of scams that are out there and I, I just feel bad when people get scammed, guys. So I do my part. I try to keep it as real as possible on this channel. No cap. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this crypto update. If you did, help your crypto bro out by hitting the thumbs up and subbing to the channel. I'll talk to you guys later.